Welcome back to Zombies of the Parents of the Dead. It's true. Yes. Yes. It's the very 20th episode. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's our 20th episode anniversary. Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have a feeling the next one is going to be the 21st episode anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> Might be. You Might never know. You never know. Episode anniversaries are only when it's divisible by 10. I see. <laughs> so uh, we're punching. The zombie has a squiggly on it because we're not using it. So yeah. let's just get into writing another test. Yeah. And you can, instead of just writing a different test, just uh, test some more stuff. I'm going to actually just do this. Okay. Yeah. But I had a I have uh, Stop, 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 stop. I have mm -hmm. an idea. You have an idea? Yeah. We will add a value adding test mm -hmm. uh, to force the things that you're doing. Okay. So we added the test that you cannot punch on an existing zombie. Mm -hmm. Now we will... Uh, um, Cannot uh, remove life that is not there. Mm -hmm. So if this guy has like two life, mm -hmm. yeah. uh, take one. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately we regret that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then I give him the double fist mm -hmm. in the face. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, then uh, he will still only lose one heart. Yeah. And this is in a different dice, mm -hmm. just mixing it up here. Different zombie. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, yeah, the target. kind doesn't really matter. Yeah, no. But the target does matter. Mm -hmm. So one damage is still... So should, this should, is, should still be one. Yeah. Okay, so but this because, is... But you did not kill the zombie, so we are going to... Okay, get, this was annoying because the numbers are too similar. So I will do this instead. Mm -hmm. And so now I have th three punches, mm -hmm. two life... It will take two damage. Okay. Yeah. You also have to update the die IDs. Yeah. Uh, zero and one. Mm -hmm. And uh, the health will then be zero. No, no. no. Two. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, but th this was no point. I don't uh, really want to do all this. I want to... This will give me a bunch of events. Yeah, but we're filtering them, so that might be okay. okay. So that, that's okay. We can actually we, see, we, can, yeah, we, we can check the entire event. Yeah, we don't have to strip down the event. Mm. Yes. So there we go. Now you can uh, fix the uh, fake implementation. Yeah, for sure. Uh, because we have a very useful get die effects that right. we need to use. Yep. To um, to uh, effects mm -hmm. like this. Um, get die effect it takes just dice so it's uh, the vowels of the dice in the game mm -hmm. and now I can do damage and you're making it hard for me for sure okay yeah <laughs> I do realize that maybe I yeah punches we're biting more than we really need to but yeah. punches you're a grown man you'll get through this <laughs> with some whining <laughs> Of course, uh, you're a grown man. <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth. Oh, let's see. So now we have... Actually, I think just man is enough to qualify. <laughs> I'm going to do keys, punches. Mm. So I don't have to do this. So I can do die IDs for the punches. And this is the zombie health. Yeah, that that's the easy one. So yeah, now so you just uh, you're just one... Min away. Yeah, because we have this one here. Yeah. Uh, or is it max? It will be max. It will be min. No. It's max. Because it's damage. So the maximum damage is the minimum health. It's the lowest value of the punches and the health. Pretty sure. Current Ah, uh, yeah. Health. <laughs> I'll just retire in the <laughs> <You're>, background. <Yeah. laughs> this is why we have tests. Yeah. And uh, two programmers. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> so now we have something green. Yes, very nice. So this is a punch zombie effect. But yeah. of course, this kills the zombie. It does kill the zombie. So it probably needs to happen more stuff. But that doesn't like move us towards showing no. the people the things they want to see. So maybe we just start here. <laughs> 
people want to see the zombies getting punched in the face <laughs> yes. yeah, right well, in why their mouth. Why else would you be here? So, yeah. So we have enough to do that. We just need to actionize these uh, new events. Yeah, that's true. Because uh, if we now, for, for fun, try and punch a zombie, we will get no yeah. matching clause, punch zombie, in. It's, it's an update game, actually. So we can do that first. We just mm -hmm. uh, know up that. We can know up it, but I feel like we've not stumbled over that quite a few times. So maybe we just <laughs> yeah. bite the bullet. I, immediately after I suggested it, I remember that, whoa, <laughs> we'll <laughs> fell for this so many times. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just fix it. Yeah, update game. Uh, because if we know up it, then you can just keep punching the zombie and it will never die. That's true, and that's pretty on point. Yeah. Let's see. So we update the game, and we have... At this point, we no longer care about dice at all. Ah, it's beautiful. It's just zombies. Yes. So I'm going to I'm going to take a look at the test down here because we have an event already. Because the dice are kind of annoying to work with. <laughs> they are. <laughs> or at least they're annoying to type out by hand. Yeah, that's it. So we have a zombie mm -hmm. and has this max and current and here's the damage. I'm going to make him not die. At the moment, I want to just... Uh, yeah, okay, sure. And what I want afterwards is for this zombie to have a little bit less health. I want him about yeah, one health instead of three. One health, yeah. So that's about it, I think. There you go, no question clause. Okay, I'm up for the task. So uh, where am I? You, both, are tests, tests. both are tests. <laughs> <laughs> tests everywhere I see. Mm -hmm. I am looking for update game here, and it's called Punched Zombie, which is P, goes here. Mm. So for those of you who don't remember, we're very strict about alphabetizing our yes, stuff. Yes, please it makes sense. alphabetize yes. it. Yes. <laughs> uh, and it's just, uh, oops, once again, and mm -hmm. it'll just be Punch Zombie Game. Oops. Yeah. Like that. And at this and point, I'll our... Destructure this one. I'll say target and demolish. Yeah, because... It's uh, actually a zombie ID. The, the, the code that creates the event has all the logic around how much damage can it, is supposed to be delivered. So you, don't, you yeah. can really just update it now. Yeah, the event tells us exactly what happens. So we just, just perform it. Yeah. yeah. Um, update in, probably, mm -hmm. game... Uh, zombies, uh, zombie ID, and uh, health? health. Oh, did we make a suitable data structure? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. And this is why we're using maps with keys instead of lists. Yes. Excellent. Doesn't that look beautiful? That's perfect. Uh, uh, it doesn't work especially then. if it works. <laughs> you That's... know, much in claws punch zombie. Um... What's going on here? Did I send more stuff? Yeah, yeah, you, you double, I double, double it. vectored it. Double vectored it. Um, still no matching. Oh, you undoubled vectored it at the wrong at the wrong place. I think. No, yeah, you're just you did it in the wrong place. Yeah, yeah. undo and find the actual test that I was failing. Yes, uh, update game. Punch zombie here. There's yeah. double vector. Yeah. Sorry. And there we go. Now it's beautiful. Now it's beautiful. Yeah. And then we can take. The same thing over to our actionizer. Yes. So I'll write the test for that one. Uh, this is just a bunch of actionized tests. Def test, actionize, um, punched zombie. And tell me, what does that need to do? Well, punching zombies is sort of involved. Um, we have to look at the DOM structure, I think. Because yes. we're going to render some punches and they will animate and the hearts are going to be reduced. So we have like something there to um, to consider. Okay, zombies here. So we have, um, okay, so there's something called zombie punches mm -hmm. and there's uh, one to five. This is just the direction they're coming in from. Yeah. So we want to round robin them. Like with the yeah, so if you if you punch have. seven times, you want to do punch, 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 punch from the different directions. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So we we already have two. We have two damage. So maybe we want it to be zombie punch. Okay. So we need to have. Um, I'll 
try to make some notes, uh, like direction or what if... if you remember, we are just sending classes yeah, to yeah. stuff. Punch class. So there's a punch class, yeah. Uh, this will be like a zombie punch uh, one. Yeah. And zombie... Uh, the, the other zombie punch uh, class will be later. Uh, no, look, uh, it's um, the zombie has a punched one to five. If you see, look at the zombie the area. Mm -hmm. There's punched one to five. These are the actual punches. The the zombie punch X are, can always be rendered there. It can just be static. So okay, okay, the, okay. So the punched class. Okay. So there's a zombie class. Zombie class will have punched uh, one. Ah, so we're gonna have to do like a sequence of these. Yes. One, one at a time. One and then at a time. wait a little bit and then do another. Yeah. Okay. So punched one, that will be the first one. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, that's it, I think. We can start there. That will be something. That will be something. Yeah. Mm. So it will have to be associated in the zombie. Um, zombies and zombie one. Mm -hmm. And it will have. Um, is, I don't think zombie class is correct because it could also it will also have a type there. So okay, so it's punched or falling. Those are maybe zombie class is okay. It's just weird to have it on the zombie. <laughs> you, yeah, I don't disagree, but it might be like a status class or something like that. I'm not sure. Punch class. It's, it also includes falling. Maybe just class. Class. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Class. Mm -hmm. Uh, so this is uh, roughly what I'm looking for at this point, mm -hmm. um, except it's going to have to be like this. Yes. Uh, and there will be more? There will be more later. Yeah. We can just start here. If we start here, then we can actually see it on screen and then... Uh, okay. Can, yeah. Then we get a little bit of a visual payoff at the end of the episode. Okay. We'll try to do that quickly. It then. is our episodiversary after all. <laughs> That's true. Yes. So we have the punch zombie. And now I think this is the correct spot for it. So this is punch zombie, if I can recall correctly. Um, and I got some keys and those are the zombie ID. There's the damage, which I'm going to ignore for now. There's the die IDs and the health. Oh, we also need to update the health, of course. Yes, several yeah. things. I'm just uh, we, yeah, 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 yeah. right now. No, I just I just realized. Yeah. yeah. So this is the zombie ID, and that's about it. Yeah. Uh, we're going to do expand on this in the next episode, but yeah. let's uh, we're try on, it. We're on overtime, so we'll just try it. See yeah. what we have so far. And, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Uh, so we have a zombie up here, and it will now have a class, and it already has a class, which is the kind. So we're going to do. Um, this kind of class, yeah, a bit yeah. weird, but <laughs> sure, <laughs> why not? Yeah, um, let's uh, try it out. Punching a zombie. Oh, did you say? Yeah, he he, he nudged a little he bit. Nudged a little bit. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And the reason why uh, is that we haven't rendered the, uh, the actual punches. Yeah, so the, let's, let's let's do that, that as well. Yeah, yeah. So zombie punches is supposed to be in the zombie. Uh, inside of here. Yeah, because what you're saying is that they will always be rendered and the CSS will just uh, yes. use transitions to show them. Exactly. Yeah. So one to five. So I'm going to do range one to six like this. Mm -hmm. Good uh, choice. <laughs> I'm, oh, excellent. Well done, CSS guy. <laughs> also, yeah. <laughs> yes. Like this. I think that's it. Uh, yeah, Did you see it? it was a fist. Okay, very cool. Let's try one more. And then we actually need some fists, though. It's a good thing we can reroll. Boom! Cool. That's what I call episode 20. It's a good 20 -versary. And to get Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, remember, when the birds fly north, rain is coming.